Hello, my name is Thomas Rogers. Um, I do stained glass. Um, I kind of got started a few years back um, doing a grant proposal and then I just started doing classes and then teaching classes and I've been doing it ever since. Um, just kind of what keeps my creative creativity alive is just kind of seeing what's out there. I do a lot of searches for things. Um, a lot of ideas come from what people want from me. They ask me, they see something they really like and then I transform it into glass. Um, some of the greatest challenges is I've been doing a lot more stuff like 3D inspired pieces. So not just a flat panel. Um, and since I never really did that well in math, that's always been a challenge to me is trying to figure out the right angles and how everything fits together and stuff like that. Um, just the greatest thing I love about this is seeing somebody when they request a piece and then I give it to them and to see their face is that they see how it turned out, like their vision and what I could do with it. Um, and then just, you know, when my friends are like, hey, I gave it to somebody for a gift and they really loved it, um, that sort of thing. Um, one of the new things that I've been working on is I've been working on like these little 3D like cacti. So I've been making them like three dimensional and then putting them in like the little pots. Cause you know, we all love plants, but if you're like me, you kill everything that's green. So this way you never have to water it. You never have to worry about anything. Um, I've been also working on a few spinners. So they'll spin in the wind and I've been doing them all like three dimensional and stuff like that. I have a few different examples of those. Um, different shapes, different patterns, different texture, glass. Um, I've also been working on some pieces like just some lawn pieces that you can just put in your garden for a little extra color. Um, here's another spinner I've been doing. And you can see all the different ways when the light hits it. And then, you know, of course, I love my rainbow stuff. So anything rainbow, here's a little peace sign I did. So yeah, just been experimenting with different mediums and different ideas and stuff like that.